One of the moms accused in the college admissions scandal has made her first court appearance. She and her husband are accused of handing over hundreds of thousands of dollars in Facebook stock in exchange for their daughter's admission to UCLA. Prosecutors say she got in as a soccer recruit, but no one can seem to remember ever seeing the girl on a soccer field. A mom leaves federal court, accused of taking part in a brazen scam to get her daughter into UCLA. You have anything to say? Davina Isaacson and her husband Bruce, a wealthy real estate developer, are the latest high-powered parents charged in the college admission scandal. Their oldest daughter, Lauren, was admitted to UCLA in 2017 as a recruit on the school's elite soccer squad. Bruins win! The number two team in America. UCLA's website lists Lauren as number 41, a midfielder. But she's not depicted in the team photo. Under her stats, a blank slate. Apparently, she never played in a single game at UCLA. Her profile claims she was team captain for Woodside Soccer Club, a travel team in her hometown in Northern California. But team officials say they have no record of her ever having played there. Nobody's heard of Lauren Isaacson. According to the feds, Lauren's parents paid William Singer, the ringleader of the college admission scam, $250,000 in Facebook stock as a bribe to get Lauren into UCLA. They also allegedly paid another $250,000 in bribe money to get their other daughter, Audrey, into USC as, get this, a fake rowing recruit. The same scheme actress Lori Laughlin allegedly used to get her two daughters into USC. The scandal has legit college rowers up in arms. We caught up with the young women of the Long Beach State women's rowing team. They are elite athletes who have the grit to get up at 5 a.m. and train three hours every day before class. They say they are infuriated that any student would fake credentials to get into a top school. We know how hard it is to go out there and give your all every race. And so knowing that there's someone who thinks that they can just fake their way through that. I think it's ridiculous that people think they have to resort to that. At the time of the arrest, the Isaacsons reportedly were in conversation with Singer about helping their younger son with his college admissions test.